flash review flash review hey guys what's up and welcome to flash review the best series on youtube and today what we are going to be doing is reviewing well a bunch of games you see i thought a f uh, i could occasionally make a type of flash review where i review a bunch of games so today i'm going to be reviewing four games so the first game is slope S sloop slope is it is it is it sloop anyways it doesn't really matter what its name is we're just going to be you know talking about it and the first thing i realized is musically this game is kind of let's just say uh not too good all right i'm just gonna put it out there the music is way too loud so when you're trying to fucking speak you can't even fucking hear the words how loud it is you don't even know how much talking from it is which is why what i did is i muted it and when a game's music is so bad that you have to mute it it probably means that the music is very bad which is why musically this game gets a one out of two now let's get into <laughs> graphically this game is actually pretty good you'll come to find i mean you could say the graphics aren't very sloppy Anyways, it has 3D graphics, which you don't see in a lot of Flash games. And, for the most part, they are pretty good. Which is why I'm gonna have to give them a 3 out of... Nah, just kidding, I'm fucking with you guys. The graphics aren't actually that good. The problem with them is that the hitboxes are a little bit not the greatest i mean like look at how i died right there like like come on really 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 game that's the problem with making 3D games, which is why the graphics get a 3 out of 4. Now, let's move on to... The gameplay is pretty fun, actually. I mean, you start out, you know, going pretty slow, like a fucking small dick, you know, a small dick uh, gamer, right? Right, but then you, you know, get going faster, and then you're like, oh, okay, I'm not a small dick gamer anymore. You know, I'm a dick surprise dungeon gamer. And then you get going so fast that you're like, haha, now I'm a Rick and Moro shit I died. But like the other things in this game, there is problems. Two words. By that, I mean when you die, you get sent all the way back. And pretty much, well, actually, nothing changes. Right? So, yeah. If not for the repetitive gameplay, I would give it a 3, but sadly, I have to give it a 2 out of 4. The fi final score gets a 5 out of 10. Next game. I hope it isn't lame. Game 2. Hope it doesn't smell like poo. Hey guys, so for Dickman, I mean, Stickman. I'm just gonna randomly, you know, start a timer right now. And, uh, yeah, let's just get into. There is none. There, there's, there's, there's no music. The game doesn't. The game doesn't have music. Come on. No music. None at all. But there are, however, sound effects.
And I'll talk about those, I guess. The sound effects are mediocre, to to be honest. Like, they're not great, they're not bad, but you bet they aren't special, lad. Which is why I'm gonna have to give the music a 2 out of 4. Now let's get into... The graphics are simple and appealing. It's, uh, while well, you play as a stick man. And it does play into the comedy of the game. Just watch this clip here. Hmm? Hmm. The uh, animation quality is also pretty good. It's above average, but not incredible. And the hitboxes are... There aren't any hitboxes. But uh, I don't want to talk about the gameplay too much, because obviously we have to get in two. Now this is where the game kind of falls apart, to be honest. So basically, you start playing the game, and then you're given, you know, six options. And then you're like, okay, you know, this game is going to be pretty long. These uh, options will obviously lead me to more options. And, oh, stop the timer. I've been talking about the game for longer than I played the game. Because the game is really short, and if you guess the right, uh, thing immediately, then the game is literally a few seconds long. The end credit scene is much, 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 much longer than the actual game. And I did every one. Whatever, let's get into the next game. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to give it a rating. Six out of ten. Next game. I hope it isn't lame. Game three. I'm going to re. Mac Man is a game about Stack Man, where he plays Fact Man, and you blow stack. And you blow stacks. This game is the best game I've ever played in my entire life, and I'm 10, so, you know, that's a, that's a lot of games. In all serious, though, uh, Jackman yeah. is a really original idea, you know, it's a, it's just a really original, you know, you, uh, go, the, you're, uh, you're pack, you you play as a man. Not really, he's not really even a man. You play as a, a thing, and then you run away from the ghosts, uh, and you, then you get the pellets. If you get them all, you win. And, um, there's these big boy pellets, so when you, uh, get them... Then you can eat the piece of shit ghosts, but then they just, uh... Then they just re-respawn, so you don't really... It's kind of weird. It's a really uh, original idea. It kind of reminds me of this one game from the 80s. Uh, you might not have heard of the game. It's called... Mario. Mario was a game where you uh, join the mafia and then you're forced to beat the shit out of a uh, gigantic ape. It's based on a true story, actually. But let's not talk about Mario. Let's talk about uh, this game. Uh, let's get into. So, um, the music, I forget. <laughs> so, 
sorry about that, guys. Um, yeah, I don't actually remember how good the music was. So I'm going to have to give this segment a two, two out of two on the music. Because <laughs> I, I forget. <laughs> Let's talk about the get the graphics. They're um really original. They're just great overall. It actually reminds me, you know, it reminds me of a different game from the eighties. It reminds me of uh. It reminds me of this one game. It's called um. I believe it's called uh Mario. Um. Mario 3. Yeah, it reminds me of that game. See, in Mario 3, you play as Mario. And you, uh, go around. And, uh. It's a really good game. 10 out of 10. But, uh, uh let's, uh. Let's not talk about Mario 3, though. Let's talk about this game. The graphics are amazing. I'm gonna have to give them a 3 out of. Um. Out of four. Three out of four. Alright, so... Jiggity Jiggity Jack... Um... Let's talk about, uh... Hold on, hold on. Now let's talk about... So, uh, the gameplay-wise, this game is, again, pretty original. It's, uh... It doesn't... It reminds me of a game from the 80s. Uh... Well, uh, let's not talk about that, though. And, um, you go, go around, I already explained it, I believe, uh, you know, it's really, really just solid gameplay. It reminds me of this game called Pac-Man, kinda. It's a game where you play as a, a thing, you know what, I, I think this game might be a Pac-Man ripoff, guys. I think it may be, I don't know, uh, next game. Game for your mom's a whore. Hey guys, Reactathon here, and today we're going to be reacting to this amazing video called Printer. Now, let's react, guys. This is going to be really exciting. But before we get into this, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hell yeah. Please. Anyways, let's get into this, guys. Printer, 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 ah, oh, printer, 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 printer. Printer, 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 printer. A printer. Printer, 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 printer. Printer, printer, printer. Printer, printer, printer. Printer, printer. Printer, 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 printer. That video was fucking epic. Am I right, guys? Like, like, am I right? Ha, <laughs> ha, make sure to tune in next time when I react to my own birth.